Hey, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to learn about the flower parts and their function. So plant, that is a plant, we know that plant consists of many parts like root, stem, leaves, fruits and flower. Among them, the beauty and the smell of the flower make them most attractive part of the plant. They make the nature colorful and pleasant. We use them for various purposes like a decoration to symbolize our culture, emotion, etc. Moreover, a flower is a reproductive unit of the plant. So as you can see, the flower is more beautiful and very, very beautiful. Now, I like flower a lot. Now, now it's time to learn the morphology of the part of the flower morphology so flowers serve as a significant function in plant as there as a reproductive part it ensure the continuation of the plant species by process called reproduction you heard this thing generally it consists of the petals as you can see on your screen the the brightly color part which attract the pollinating agent this part is known as the also known as the corolla as you can see this is the petals it's also known as the Corolla. Now let me talk about the sepals. So sepals or calyx is green color part beneath the part in order to protect rising birds. Now let me talk about the carpal which is a female part. So carpal represents the female reproductive part of the flower as you can see over here. This is the female part and it has a stigma style ovary which collectively known as the pistil. Now let me talk about the male reproductive part that is the stamen. The male reproductive part organ consists of the two parts namely anther and the filament which are usually yellow in color. Anther is the bilobe sac that produces a store pollen whereas the filament store they support the anther. So last is the peduncle. Peduncle is a stem which supports the inflorescence. I hope you like this video. You can refer this picture to see all those things. So thanks for the watching. Meet you in the next video. Thank you.